What's up everyone? It's Kanan back with another video and today we are unboxing something else besides Pokemon. That's right. We are going to be opening some Magic the Gathering. It is the Strixhaven School of Mages uh, bundle box or booster box, whatever you want to call it. I do know they sh they've changed the name several times. I've also got 10 other packs, so that's 20 altogether. You guys know that when I open stuff, I like to make do it big. But uh, even though it's really expensive. So I've only opened Magic once on this channel. And I stated in that one that I didn't know a lot about Magic. And truth is, I still don't. Um, I've always been interested in it. I've always been interested in the art. And the biggest reason why I'm starting with this one is School of Mages interests me. Like, I like mages. And usually in RPGs, when you can choose between a warrior, a rogue, or a mage, I usually always go mage. Um, so yeah, why not? And um, yeah, just something different. And plus, right now, magic is way easier to find than Pokemon. So let's get on over to TCG Player. All right, so tell you the truth, there's really nothing hugely big in this set. Um, the highest card is Belladros Winterbloom, which is borderless for 2130. Then you've got Professor Onyx, borderless for 1716. Belladros Winterbloom, which I, I'm believing is the regular card, 1625. Shadrick's Silver Quill, Borderless, 1255. Regular Professor Onyx, 1246. So we've already got five cards here, and it seems like they're, you know, over the $10 mark. So there's probably a bunch of $5 bills in this set. So. I don't even know if I'll hit them because I don't want to bore you guys and look for every single card. So I'll just have to uh, keep an eye out on it while we open these. So yeah, either a Professor Onyx, a Belladros Winterbloom, or a Shadrick Sil Silver Quill is what we want. So hopefully I remember that. So let's get to opening. All right. So let's get this open. I've got TCG player up on my screen. That way I can hopefully keep up as I open. And if there is a card that I open that is a good card and I miss it, let me know, please. Though chances are I'll probably figure it out once I'm done recording. Um, so yeah, let's slide this open. Whoop. Inside is the poster. I usually don't use them because I like uh, displaying the boxes. This is pretty cool looking. Whoop. Very, very cool looking. It's like pretty much all the different... Uh, Colleges, you got Sil Silver Quill, Prismaria, Winter Bloom, Lore Hold, Quandrix. That's pretty cool. All righty. This right here is pretty much the box that you can keep the cards in. <laughs> There's the security. <laughs> Set all that down here. All righty. And inside, you've got your spin down, which these are really cool. I've always thought these were cool, and there's a lot of people in the uh, Magic fandom that uh, collect these. So those are really cool. Then we've got our 10 packs. So we got 20 in all. Then you've got your basic lands that come with every set. And then you got this one, which is pretty much cards that come with every ever every, every uh, box. But you also get a foil card. It is a Archmage er Emeritus. Yeah, that's another thing. I am very bad at the names on in these cards. So, yeah, expect a lot of mispronunciation. Okay, so I'm going to mix these up, mix them up, mix them up. I 
That way I can't remember what's from the box and what is from the boosters that I bought uh, by themselves. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's column two. The other ten will be column one. All righty. I mean, we're, I'm using the uh, webcam that me and Jess originally started with, so it's a bit better than that camera I was using for a top-down. But um, I want to get a, another one like I'm using for this because it's way better. But uh, we'll see because you still, still not great. All right. Let's go real quick through. Hello. Quandrix Campus, Professor's Warning. Never, never want to get a warning from the professor. Drop a rust secure. Meter. I'm trying to learn when the commons and when the uncommons end. Mage Duel, Elemental Summoning. That's cool looking. Wormhole Serpent. I'm thinking it's, it's this emblem right here. That lets you know when you're in like commons, uncommons, rare, stuff like that. Spell satchel. Sparring regimen. That looks nice. Oh, oh, okay. This looks like a really nice card. I have no idea if it uh, is one. But that is really, really nice. I'm actually going to lay these out and then we got a foil soothsayer add it and then an elemental creature okay I want to look up this card real fast just to make sure it uh, isn't like a card card because very good chance it won't be. But that's a very nice looking card, so I just want to make sure. Because like I said, I am not as... Um, savvy with these cards as I am. Nah, it's not really. It's... 34 cents still a very nice looking card though so i am happy with that if it's a cool looking card i will uh be happy about it <sighs> so go through the commons pretty quickly I believe if it's a black symbol, it's like commons and stuff like that, like it's the cards you'll normally usually get. Okay, explo explosive welcome. Expressive lertination, I believe. Augmentary Pugilist. So that is one of those. Ooh, that is a nice looking card. Grape Shot, but I bet you anything, it's not one of the huge ones that we need. And then a Spirit Token Creature. Like I said, if any of these cards that I pull out are actually really, really good, let me know. Um... Cause like I said, it's there's so many cards in Magic that's it's really hard. Like with Pokemon, they make it a little easier, I think, because of you know full art, foil, rainbow foil, you know stuff like that. <sighs> As always, the art on these are always great. I've always enjoyed Magic uh, for that. Cause I'm very much into. Oh, I kind of I like that one a lot. I'm really into like 
stuff like very high fantasy stuff like even though I love both Mass Effect and Dragon Age, I tend to prefer Dragon Age just because I love elves, dwarves, magic, dragons, which is another reason why I love both Star Wars and Lord of the Rings, but I prefer Lord of the Rings. Professor of Symbology. That's a interesting card. Karok Wrangler. Shadowing Lariat, I think. Not sure. Manifestation Sage. Snakeskin uh, Veil. A very, uh, very nice looking card. And Pest for the Creature. So I've got the feeling these kind of cards are almost in every pack. But they're very nice looking. They're like, I wish they were worth more to history because they are very nice looking cards. I'm going to speed it up here a little bit, get through the commons quicker. Dragon's Approach. I think I've already seen that card, but it's a cool looking card. Elemental Summoning, Cadrock Wrangler again, start from scratch. I pulled that one. Crackle with power. Okay, let's put that one there because it's a different color. I don't... Village Rights. Okay. And just a Magic Arena card, and I believe that's it. Okay. Get through these commons. That's a very nice looking card. Needlethorn Drake. That's a v also, guys, if you hear a uh, sound in the background, it's uh, our fan. It's really hot in here. Spring Main Curvin. That's a very interesting looking creature. Pop quiz, okay. No one likes pop quizzes. Symmetry Sage. Golden Ratio. Restored of Symbology. Archmage. Uh, Emeritus. And a Ottoman Harvest. Another Pest. Alrighty. I have no idea if I'm doing good or not. <laughs> I, I really, really don't. Moldering Karok. Eureka moment. Eureka! Bio man. Okay, I cannot. That's a long word. So, very nice looking card, though. Campus guide. Mage Duel, okay. Instance Infusion. Blood Age General. Hmm. Eye Witch, that's a very disgusting looking thing. Quadrix Apprentice. Agent Dunspeaker. Dragon's Guard Elite. So, put that there. And a Cultivate. And an Avatar, Token Creature. I have no idea. I'm just going by the colors of the emblems on the cards. <laughs> I'm guessing, like I said, I'm guessing black is commons. So... Pretty much going to do uh, just the just the big cards, pretty much. Since I don't know en enough about magic to really talk about the other cards. Dina Soul Steeper. Well, she's very wild looking. Necrotic fumes. Well, that sounds lovely. 
Oh, this is a really pretty card. Expressive. I think I've already gotten that card, actually. Huh. Ooh. Uvilda, Dean of Perfection. That is a very nice looking card. I might uh, need to look at that one. Claim the Firstborn. Well, that's never good. And another pest. Let me look this card up real fast. I just want to make sure. You villain. Okay. Because that just seems like a really nice looking card. But like I said, it's uh, Dean of Perfection. Eh, $2.47. So. Oh, uh, no, the pre-release one is $2. The one in the actual box is $0.22. Cents. <laughs> My luck sucks. Okay. Uh, teach by example. Wow. Spectal Mage. That's a nice-looking card. Hunt for specimens. Oh, hey, that's never good. Defend the campus. Bayou Groff, okay, it's pretty much a, a bear, but okay. Introduction to Annihilation, well, that's not good. Golden Ratio. Culmination of Studies and Sign in Blood. And then a Treasure, Token Artifact. Well, one thing's for sure, we've not gotten any of the big, big cards, but what else is new? Silver Quill Campus. How big are these campuses? <laughs> Every time I found one of the campuses, it's a really, really big, build, big uh, building. Vortex Runner. Heated debate. Teachings of the Arikas. Kelpie God. That's very interesting looking. Closing statement. Dueling coach. Demigoth Titan. And a gift of estates. That's a very nice looking card. And just a playing card. So I got two of these kind of cards in the pack. I'm guessing that's good. This one, however, I don't know. Something tells me to look this one up. It might just be like, oh, please, please be something. But who knows? It could be. Gift of Estates. Whoops, I typed it in wrong. Let's see. Foil etched. I don't think this is foil etched. Can't really tell, but if it is, it's a dollar thirty. If it's not, it's sixty-five cents. <laughs> oh boy, such a noob right now. Relic sloth. Oh, okay. Crushing disappointment. Yeah, that's every time I open magic. It seems like. Uh, Environmental Sciences. Stonebinder's Familiar. It's a puppy dog. Demigoth Woe Eater. That's a pretty awesome looking card. Explosive Welcome. Fervent Mastery. 
and infuriate and a foil morality spear okay out of all out of 10 packs two foils <laughs> so yeah don't know exactly what this one is because it's kind of orange i don't know what that means but i'm guessing golden it's supposed to be the rares um don't really know what silver means maybe those are i don't know someone's gonna have to school me on this so we're into the next 10 packs Winter Bloom Campus. That looks like a cool campus to take part in. Blood Research. Well, that's never good. Eager first year. Yeah, we're all eager our first years of school. Little do we know by the time it's over, we'll be a husk of our former selves. Ooh, Mentor's Guidance. That's a nice looking card. Oh, now this one. This one looks nice. Rutha. M Miracular artist. I'm gonna keep this one out because I just I like the way that one looks. Thunderous orator, vanishing verse. It's a nice looking card, and another eliminate, <laughs> and a fractural creature. Alrighty. Thrilling Discovery, Archway Commons. That's pretty. That's really pretty. Mage Duel, Ageless Guardian, Resculpt, Heated Debate, Introduction to Annihilation again, Ten the Pests, or Brawl Juke, Strickhaven Stadium. That's nice looking. Lightning Bolt, okay, and a Foil Environmental Science, and a Creature Fractural. Okay. Flat, li, lash of Malice, okay. Field Trip, hey, those were always fun. Illuminate History. Golden Ratio again. The Billoplex. And a Shock. Alrighty, moving on through these, we've got seven counting this pack I'm opening right now. <sighs> Archway Commons again, Tangle Trap, that's a pretty cool looking card. Leech Fanatic. Ooh, Combat Professor. He's cool looking. He's an owl. Soothsayer Adept. A lot of this stuff I could see you seeing in like a Final Fantasy game or Lord of the Rings or something like that. Ingenious Inspiration. Brackish Truck. I think it looks like it's made out of poop. Deadly Brew. Jet. Jadiz Oracle of Arcavios. It's a legendary creature, human wizard. Okay. So I'm going to put that there. Growth Spiral. And a creature. It's an inkling. I have an inkling that I am doing awful. So I have, I mean... I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Sorry if it's real bright. I'm trying to make sure there's enough light on the cards. Mage, square up. Okay. 
get through these commons. Aether Helix, reduced to memory. Honor Troll, Radiant Scroll Wielder. Okay, Divine Gambit. Ooh, the, oh my gosh, this looks like a card. Oh, Whirlwind Denial. This looks like it's borderless and it's foil. Let's, uh, I'll put it right here because it looks like one of those cards. Then an elemental creature. Let's, uh, it's not one of the huge cards, but I mean, that's got to be something. That's, it looks way too nice. Whirlwind Denial. I th think it's border. Uh, it might not be borderless. I don't think it is, but it's just the way these cards look. But man, that's nice looking. Let's see what we got. Why did it go back to Gift of States when I clearly... Uh, TCG player really drives me nuts sometimes. It's like you'll type something in and it'll take you somewhere else. World Wind... I spelled it wrong again. Let's see. Foil etched. I'm guessing that's one I've got. <laughs> 24 cents. God. Uh, I think this is why a lot of people tell you don't get into magic if if you're trying to make money because it's it's not worth it. Well, if I get rid of some of these along with some of the Pokemon cards I've pulled, I'll I'll do pretty okay. Inkling summoning. Dramatic finale. Day of Judgment. That's nice looking. Another arena card. Okay. This video's gone way longer than I thought it was going to. I need to pick it up a little bit. Maybe next time I'll just completely skip the commons. But this being my first time really doing this, I wanted to uh, do it right. Spirit Song, Thunderous Orator, Bookworm, Reconstruct History, Auric Lore Mage, and negate elemental man i was really hoping that whirlwind denier was going to be something big especially since it was foil <sighs> oh that is a very interesting looking card square up scrub Bury in books. Jess is like that all the time. Buried in books. Show of confidence. Reconstruct history. Containment breach. Gnarled professor. Opt. Okay. I opt to not be upset. Two packs to go. Same, got that same card again. Make your mark. First day of class. Ugh. Ugh. Ooh, Zenomi Quadrix Prodigy. Solve the equation. Another Jed. Uh, Jadzi, Oracle, Arvacavios. 
and thrill of possibility treasure last pack square up arrogant poet <laughs> First day of class again. Plum of Forbidden. Furry Cam Snarl. Adventurous Impulse. And that is it. Okay, so I have no idea how I did. Um, but hey, that's just how it goes. I, I pulled some really nice looking cards. I know that. I really was hoping that, uh, this was going to be something, but apparently it's not. But hey, that's how it goes. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to see me open more magic, let me know. As always, guys, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, click that like button, leave me a comment. As always, guys, this is Kanan. And just love you all very, very much. Take care of yourselves out there. Stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one. See ya.